Hey everybody, this is Cappy Smack coming to you from Elite Dangerous, where I am both Elite and Dangerous, and now doing the beta. This is Beta 3, the next release for Beyond. I just did some jobs, had some fun, and I'm taking a look at turning them in. And you can see when you turn in a job, you've got choices. Now for this particular job, I can take uh, credits, some reputation and some influence, or I can take a material, less credits, and the same reputation and influence, or I can take a lot of reputation, not much money, and a little bit of influence. So at this point in time, I'm looking for money, so I'm going to take that one. Let's go on to the next job. All right, you can see my choices here. Again, I want money. Let's go on to the next job. And again, I've got the choice between money or materials or influence. So again, I'm going to take the money. And let's go on to my next job. So. Now, my other one is I can take five units of platinum and 413,000 credits. I'm not sure why they're doing that one. Or conductive ceramics if I want the materials. But again, I'm doing this for money. Well, that's turning in jobs. And if you want to take a look at picking jobs up, we can see that there are jobs for uh, wings. You can see the little wing symbol out to the left of the icon for the job. And you can see that you can collect or deliver 1557 units of liquor for 333,000 credits. That's a wing job. Now, you can take it and do it as an individual. It's probably going to take a long time. That's another difference. And you can also see what the choices will be when the job is done. Like on this one, it would be 69,000 credits, or Samarium 6, or Anomalous Bulk Scan. And these are just little quality of life things. Which I think is pretty cool. The other thing I've noticed flying around and whatnot is that when you uh, jump into a star, it used to be that your throttle would stay up and you'd keep moving forward at the same speed you were before you jump. But now when you complete a jump, your ship will slow down and virtually stop in supercruise a good distance away from the star. Again, it's a little quality of life thing. So what I want to take a look at is the uh, livery I just docked at uh, Grizzly Dock. I want to take a look at the option for change of the voice for a ship. So let's just uh, take a look at what my SRV options are. Pretty much same as before, uh, except there is a new option. And there's a new option for change in the voice of the vessel. So this is Verity. And we want to change the ship to Victor. So that's new. Mm, 
Explorer Scout was the last one I had gotten to. Soulsy Trade Peddler, blah blah blah. So, alright, I was just interested in that. So it's a Victor or a Verity. So that's kind of cool. I don't have enough money to show off the Chieftain. 20 million credits. I just don't have the credits. Well, that's all I wanted to show for this. Um, those were the main things that were sticking out while I was tooling around in the game. Kind of the other things that you'll notice are things like uh, Galnet News, which you can now get piped in. And then there are engineers. I was curious to how they changed that. Not a lot of what's going on. And of course, Galactic Powers looks like it has moved. Yep, Galactic Powers moved from the left panel to the right panel. Oh, and hey, I can pledge. Well, that's it for this video. We'll catch you next time. Be sure to like, subscribe, and share, and uh, check me out on Patreon. Cap Smack signing out.